Hello, I'm Jury Rigged, and this is The Talos Principle, where I broke last episode's video by recording it wrong, and so I've got to uh, start over a little bit today, and in doing so, since I'm right here, I'm going to go ahead and start here. Can I please pick up the... Thank you. Uh, and I need... You, no. You and you. I'll place you right there, and I need you, you, and you. And I'll place you. Damn it. There we go. Then jump. You and you. This is definitely going to be a little bit of a faster episode because this is all things that I've already done, already know how to do, don't have any questions or anything like that. Oh, that is perfect between those trees. I don't know if those would normally cut it off, but uh, they don't. So that's fantastic. Get the gears going. Yep. All right. Um, so I did try an idea or two that I had for this puzzle and. The short version, if you can't tell, I couldn't figure it out. Uh, I'd kind of like to know the solution, so if you know the solution, do feel free to comment that. And aside from that, I may very well pick up, or not pick up, but check a video of someone doing it. I need... Actually, I don't, do I? Don't need you. So I'll blow you over. And then I need to get the, oh, I need, well, I don't need the box for that, but, you know, the box is fine. And then bring the box over here. And send that over. And I could probably repeat again with, do, and put the jammer over there, but I can also just take off the fan. Ha! Can, here's the other question. Can I jump on that? Because if I can jump on that... Does it push me off? pushes me off. Okay. So I can't just do that. But I can do this. And speed up the whole process a little bit. Just a little bit. Actually, I need the fan first. Uh, and also, I guess if you can't tell, yes, this totally works. Uh, which tickles me a little bit because it's just that crazy enough of an idea that it works. I strongly doubt that I'm the first person to do it, but at the same time... Oh, nope, nope, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to select that. No. There we go. Nope, fell off. 
It actually lands you on it. Okay, that's real nice. And then what I'm looking for is right there. And just put it right there. You don't have fall damage, so there's no problem there. And it's beaming it. No problem at all. To that end, I can take this. And I don't need this anymore. I'm gonna turn that off because I don't like that buzzing sound. Record coming down here. Standing all this for a few seconds and then going back. Yeah. It totally works. I kind of feel bad about breaking it that way, but at the same time... I mean, what are you going to do, I guess? That's that's the only real solution that I could find. Um, I'm sure there's another solution, I just I can't piece together the back and forth. Because every solution that I come up with needs me to start as a hologram and record the hologram. Which just isn't how it works. So that's world five. World six, only three. So this is fairly simple. A fairly short, rather. When you uh, overcome one of my trials, do you not feel the pleasure of having discovered the proper order of things? Quote, proper order of things. That is the spark of Elohim within you. To create order from chaos. And therein is revealed the true meaning of our sigils. Sorry, just inspired by Chester's for a moment there. Have some new, uh, new names here that I don't quite recognize. I seek words to describe it, but fail. It is the overwhelming feeling that something on the edge of my understanding is very, very wrong. I feel that I'm not meant for this world, but I am not able to conceptualize alternatives. From... I'm just going to start calling this person symbols. V.0.0.0666N. And then... I'm a computer program. You're a computer program. Elohim's a computer program. Get over it. From Heisenstein, V60.1.0099. Interesting thing between these two, I don't believe we've seen a number that low in a long while. And I don't believe we've seen a number that high until, like, players actually start posting, where you got V90-somethings and stuff like that. Other than that, uh, I can't remember if or where there were any others... I don't see any. And I do have the computer here, which I have to reread all of this again. <sighs> Attention Administrator, the network connection has been reestablished. Would you like to reconnect to the previous session? Yes. Receiving messages as string. Received. Are you back? Yes. What were you trying to say before? Yes. Do these terminals talk to you at all? Yes. But how do I know I can trust you? Uh, what were you trying to say before? Don't remember. Doesn't matter. I've been trying to figure out how this place works. Sometimes it seems like there's a purpose to everything, other times not so much. I think we must be plugged into some kind of machine. I think something else is going on. What do you have to go on? And making assertion is a hazardous enterprise. I do basically think something similar to that is going on. Whether we're plugged into a machine or something. I don't know. But what do you have to go on? What else could possibly explain all this? I don't believe in demons and evil wizards. What demons or evil wizards? That's the one that makes me wonder. I think this is some kind of punishment. No, I think something has gone badly wrong. Yes, I don't believe in anything anymore. No. I think we're being prepared for something, maybe. Perhaps you have it right after all. I think something has gone badly wrong. I suppose that would explain a lot. Listen, there's something else. Maybe you can help us. Ever since I got here, I felt like something was wrong. This place plays tricks with you. You can't get your head straight. But I think I know a way to find out the truth. I was digging around about in some documents. And I kept finding references to this password. I think it, think it might be some kind of library, library master key, but I don't know how to use it. 
I have no idea either. What is it? And you shouldn't dig too deep. Library master key that we're not supposed to use. Sounds like something at the top of the tower. Probably. What is it? Swear not to go anywhere without me and I'll tell you. MLA process.bat logged in the session. Wait, what is that? Are you, what are, you, are you doing that to my terminal? I don't think this is a good idea. Session terminated. Terminating support session. Loading archive. I have Osiris 11, Reprogress, Rep 16, and Choice of Life. Osiris 11. But why, the dying men said, do the gods put all the challenges before us? Why the walls of iron and the gates of light? Why the abominable demons guarding the path? Why must our heart be judged to be as light as the feather of Mott? Why is the road to Aru so difficult? The scribe considered these words. Some say that once the paths to Aru were open, but too many sinners came, and the gods made the paths perilous to keep sin at bay. Others say that, being mortals, reference, we cannot be worthy of Aru unless we walk the path of Osiris, and so become Osiris ourselves. But I believe that Aru could never be reached otherwise, or elsewise. For like the mountain must, path must be steep, the path to Aru must be fraught with peril. As steepness and mountain are one, so are peril and paradise. They are inextricable. They create each other. Well, that might be appropriate for, like, Dead Island or something like that. But I don't know that peril and paradise necessarily... Uh, define each other in the same way as steep and mountain. I mean, steep and mountain are kind of synonymous. Peril and paradise, I get, is, is a good and evil, good can't exist without evil type thing. But, that's a stretch. And there are some references. There is an interesting parallel to this phrase in the penitential psalm. I don't know where that parallel... Look, you even get the Sunday yawns. I don't know what that parallel is referring to. I don't know uh, what the re what the one or two reference are referring to, and three is corrupt. The reference for two is here. The scribe appears to be speaking of Osiris, meaning the soul of the deceased, not the god himself. Next, we have reprogress rep sixteen. This is extremely worrying. If the link doesn't work, the whole project will lead to nothing. The hardware team must recheck everything ASAP. Response. Guys, 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 stop panicking. Look at your code again. In fact, look at line number 217 in data transfer.c. What are those two symbols just before the code? Forward slash, forward slash. That's right, the code that actually initiates the transfer wasn't even running. I'm guessing you were testing something yesterday and forgot to decommentify it. The hardware isn't broken, your brains are. Love, Aurora. And choice of life. The whole assembly stood a while, silent and collected. Let us return, said Rosellus. From this scene of mortality, how gloomy would be these mansions of the dead to whom, to him who did not know that he should never die? How gloomy would- I read this before and I didn't get it then either. How gloomy would be these mansions of the dead to him who did not know that he should never die? I don't get it. How gloomy would be these mansions of the dead to him who did not know that he should never die? So. Mansions of the Dead to someone who's alive, I guess. Well, I guess that makes a little bit of sense. I mean, just like Adam's family, basically. That what now acts shall continue its agency, and what now thinks shall think on forever. Owings to you, Osiris, Lord of Eternity, King of the Gods, whose names are manifold, whose forms are holy, you being of hidden form in these temples, or in the temples, whose Ka is holy. All the gods praise you, for you are blank... Those that lie here stretch before us, the wise and the powerful of ancient times, warn us to remember the shortness of our present state. They were perhaps snatched away while you were busy, like us, in the choice of life. Okay. Interesting. That, at least. Alright. Oh, there's the painter. What else do I have to say? I dislike that, uh... Are there even lasers in there? There aren't even lasers. I've got to put that up. I have to put that up. There aren't even... Oh, no, there are lasers. Damn it. Oh, wait. In the first one... Oh, no. This is just doors and windows. Okay. I remember these being a little challenging, but not really too bad. The trick is getting everything lined up.
can't quite. Can I? All right. So what I need to do Can't tell where my cursor is right now for some reason. Let's bring this guy over here. And I don't need this guy anymore. Connect. There we go. Wow, that was actually so much better than the first time that I did it. Man, it was a mess the first time. Where am I going? That was quick and easy, right? Got. Who is this? McTinchy? It was McTinchy. I'm not the first one to undertake these trials, that much is clear. If you're reading this, neither will have been the last. I remember this one. So here's the trick with, well, I'll tell you what the trick with this one is when it comes apparent and makes a difference. Where is the... Over here. There we go. That should work. So we've got this, and there's kind of a false, like, you, you come through here, and this is right before you, so this is where you're looking at. And the name of this challenge, is Crisscross Conundrum. So, I mean, obviously you've got to cross these somehow, I mean, you can't cross them, cross them, but, and I actually did spend a little while trying to do this and figure out where it actually goes high enough. Like, there's got to be a spot that's, that's elevated. But what it is, is there's this over here that's really easy to miss. From there, connect these two, and then you can get in here and get this one, and you just go around the long way. Oh wait, I need these first. That was silly of me. Alright, so I need this to connect there, bring this one around to connect back here, and I can actually do this with two if I put it in the right spot, I thought... No? Could I not? I can't, okay. And there we go. That one's fairly straightforward. Overall, I mean, the the dilute, not delusion, the um, guiding the eye this way and making you think you gotta do something over here, really clever, makes it into a very good puzzle. 
And then... Two more comments over here. We have... Dog. Can I look at it from the other angle, please? What's more pathetic, this shallow construct of the a world, this idiot's playground, or that I continue to solve its contrivances for lack of better sport? From dog? Then from sheep. Oh, no, I guess... Uh... Heisenstein... V60, so sheep is V69, never mind. I was wrong on that, but the V0, that's unusual. There's a lot more to it. Look what we're doing. We're solving problems, being tested, improving ourselves. Some of us fall early and get replaced, but you and me, we're still going. We're closer to the end. Which actually makes me wonder. So, like, dog is D0G and is V.55, but you've got sheep, that's the actual name, is V69. You've got Heisenberg, not Heisenberg, Heisenstein, uh, is V60. I wonder, that kind of makes me think, and then the other thing was zero. Uh, that kind of makes me wonder if it's a recursive deal. Is this from LB? I think this one's from, nope, from Fluffy. You'll be needing a special device to solve this one. Um, I wonder if... I mean, that could be hinting that it's a recursive thing. Like, um, like uh, Egyptian Arcade is the name on this one. It takes nothing but jammers, which was a pain in the ass. Uh, but... I'm wondering if this is like... Damn. Um... If it's a recursive thing where it learns over time, basically. Um... And... The developing names is significant in and of itself. Take this jammer. Run back as far as I can. All right, now I have this problem. They're going badly. I guess I may as well go ahead and bring this over here while I have it jammed. Same thing again. This did take me some time to work out. I ended up with both of them in here. I ended up with both of them out there. It does not work, let me tell you. And keys. A comment from Dog. This whole world is a desert. Even the parts that look alive are just more sand. Everything is dead or dying. Anything you, anyone who tells you different is lying. Rhymed. This part I actually figured out pretty much right away is, hey look, there's the scan lines. Well, it can't see right below it, haha. <laughs> From LB, it feels as if you've been, I've been struggling with these problems for days. Did you take so long? Uh, yes and no. I mean, the first time, it took a little while. 
I think the first video was a good 40 minutes long. This is not going to be 40 minutes long. I'll double check the video length. Um, the first video was a little while, but it wasn't it wasn't exorbitantly long. It was pretty much what I would expect for for four puzzles. Um, but this is definitely very short, all things considered, uh, because I just breezed through all these because I already knew the solutions. Um, I learned them by doing them, at least. But yeah, uh, if you would like, uh, World Seven is the only one left here, or Realm Seven, or I'm not sure what I want to call it. Uh, if you would like to see that whole video, uh, well, you can only see a quarter of it because I screwed up the resolution. If you would like to see that, though, if you'd like to be, that to be available so you can hear my thought processes and work through them and maybe figure out, uh, based on this video, some of the things that are happening in some of the environments, uh, I don't think it'll be very watchable, but I'll post it if somebody wants me to do it. Uh, I'm going to post it as, like, nine, is this nine, I think? This is episode nine or ten? Uh, dash A or something like that. Uh, if, well, anything else, if you have, wait a minute, have I looked over here? This is where I came in, isn't it? It must be, because that's door one. Yeah. Okay. Wow, so much light. I've got this room, and... I don't know how to get through this yet. I haven't done it for the other one, either. Um... Yeah, but uh, if you have any comments on the game, gameplay, my performance, or anything else, do feel free to comment. If you enjoyed, do please like, and have a good day.